That stunning number, 219,000 tweets during the finale of Dancing with the Stars, Max finally winning. But few know about the little boy who came to America with a not so warm welcome. Six, seven, eight. Loves all of you. Millions know him simply as Max, finally winning this week. But few know the story behind the boy who came to America from Ukraine, who learned how to dance as a kid. There he is, his proud dad behind the camera. He traded his teddy bear for his dancing shoes. And his family would move to America when Maxim Shmurkovsky was an early teenager. His brother Val right there. And we had heard about something that happened to him shortly after arriving in America. So we went to find him. He's a champion right here. Here he is, just hours going? after winning. Good, Good to see you. you. A few years in the making. Like nine. But who's counting? Uh, yeah, my parents. His parents. The ones he has worked so hard to impress, the parents he often thanks for bringing him to America to enjoy the freedoms here. He knows what's happening back in Ukraine. Do you watch what's happening in Ukraine? Absolutely. We grew up here with the freedoms that nobody has over there. But it wasn't easy coming here, at least not at the start. On his second day here, he got beat up. Was it the second day? Oh, yeah, the infamous story. He'd been given a pair of rollerblades by the distant relatives who welcomed them here but it was his first time using them when he ran into some tough kids in the street going after those rollerblades. But all these years later, his family still Hello. lives in New York. <laughs> his grandmother, who surprised him this year, what is this? she still lives Why in Brooklyn. So Her popularity helped a bit. <laughs> She's the most popular grandma in the neighborhood, and in her building, she, she can run for whatever she can Mayor. run for. And so tonight, a small token, not a trophy, but something else to make up for that second day in America. <laughs> They beat you up and ruined your rollerblades. Oh, it was amazing. So you did we, not get me rollerblades. So from World News, he told me it's his first pair since that day. <laughs> and about the gift from his dance partner, the Olympic gold medalist Meryl Davis, who helped him win, he told me she's simply brilliant. He congratulated them and assured him that this reporter will never be on that dance floor. You never know. You never know. You never know. But I kind of know.